In League of Legends, the crest of the Ancient Golem buff, or blue buff, is granted upon killing the Ancient Golem. On today's episode of Law Math, we'll be taking a look at how difficult it can be to kill the Ancient Golem and how valuable the buff can be. Let's take a look at the Ancient Golem now. The Ancient Golem will spawn at the 1 minute 55 second mark with health equal to 1500 plus 90 times the amount of minutes that have passed in the game. It will respawn every 5 minutes after being killed. The Ancient Golem has attack damage equal to 65 plus 1.825 times the amount of minutes that have passed in the game, 0.613 attack speed, and 200 movement speed. It also has 20 armor and 0 magic resistance. Based on the Ancient Golem's armor and magic resistance, it will take 1908 physical damage or 1590 magic damage to kill the Ancient Golem at the 1 minute 55 second mark. These values will increase by 108 physical damage and 90 magic damage each minute. Now let's take a look at just how beneficial the blue buff can be. The champion who kills the Ancient Golem will be granted experience points equal to 220 plus the amount of minutes that have passed in the game times 2.5. At the 1 minute 55 second mark, a champion will have to kill about 1 minion wave to get more than 220 experience. Points. It will also be granted gold equal to 72 plus the amount of minutes that have passed in the game times 0.332. The buff will grant a champion 5 mana per second plus their maximum mana times 0.005. It will also be granted 20% cooldown reduction. The mana regeneration has a stat value of 1500 gold plus 1.5 gold times the champion's maximum mana. The cooldown reduction has a stat value of 644 gold. On the champion with the highest level 18 mana in the game, Janna, the buff will have a value of 4325 gold. On the champion with the lowest level 18 mana in the game, Poppy, the buff will have a value of 3200 231.5 gold. This video was requested by Alex Goldie with a $20 donation to Charity Water. If you'd like to get your topic on law math, please consider doing the same at the link in the description. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you'd like to be informed whenever I release new videos. Click the annotation on the screen if you'd like to see the previous law math episode. You can also like law math on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and watch me livestream on Twitch. Thanks for watching this episode of law math.